Uh, hello guys, this is my Kung Fu Flash for Commodore 64 revision. Uh, I have changed many stuff in original design as it didn't completely follow my personal uh, hardware uh, follow-ups. So uh, first, first uh, device, hand assembled, uh, programmed via ST-Link. I'm gonna test it. Let me put it inside the Commodore. Of course, you must forgive me as Commodore is not my uh, beloved machine. I'm rather into Atari a bit, but let's start. Okay, we've got uh, self-loading self last uh, soft. Let's start. So we have got menu working. Uh, Let's load some game, for instance, Ghostbusters. Game is already loading. A few words, oh, a few words about the hardware changes. First of all, I have uh, swapped micro SD card to regular SD card. Here in my version, we use Heroes Heavy Duty Push and Pull SD slot, very known from uh, high HC, flop emulators, Ultra Saturn, and other devices I produce. Uh, I have added uh, also LED indicators to show if the buttons are pressed, <coughs> just for fun. Uh, we've got a button one LED indicator, button two LED indicator, and between them, there is a third LED that indicates working of uh, uh, indicating uh, SD card read write operations. In original design, in original designs, those buttons uh, were actually pulled low constantly, and when uh, action was taken, uh, buttons were uh, connected to supply, what I, power supply, what I didn't like. So with this simple hex inverter, I have uh, reversed the polarity of working buttons. So buttons are always high, connected to the VCC through resistors. And when the button is sprayed, pressed, uh, CPU receives low state. It's all possible due to, due to this extra cheap hex inverter. Also, power supply has been changed and uh, reworked. We have protection diodes, we have transils. Uh, according to the original designs, I also have changed uh, mini USB port to micro USB port. Also removed all uh, jumpers, added deep switch. A uh, word mentioning is also fact that uh, all the lines uh, to SD card are properly now uh, pulled up and clock lines is also equipped with the small capacitor to reduce peaks on the clock line. Uh, it will be very helpful with the very new uh, SD HC cards. So uh, once again, I'm gonna show you how does it work. We turn it on. Actually, it's loading last game. We have loaded. It's mentioned before Ghostbusters game. Space. You must forgive me once again. I'm not into Commodore. Now we have some uh, loading from CPU to the Commodore. Let's hope it works. Okay, it works. Uh, let's start the game. Yay! Works. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'm gonna show you once again the final, the final first prototype. Also, I wanna show you the case for it case will be transparent like side three cartridge uh, all the leds will be visible from inside it will give you a very nice glowing effect so this device will be soon available at my shop it will be uh, smd assembled at my production line and tested here so i hope you enjoyed
see you soon.